it's Forest of Rain Wayne and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be showing you the evolution of all my drawings. So like from like two years ago to like now current day. Um, it has definitely evolved since then. It's, it's definitely quite different from before. So um, yeah, I will show you what my drawings were like two years ago. So, at that time, I didn't really know how to draw. Like, for me, my dragon, like, my dragon body was this. Like, here's a head, alright. Here's a head, horns, body, leg, 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 tail, and wings. That was my basic dragon drawing, and then, like, the... I I knows little connector thing that dogs and cats have. So yeah, this was my basic dragon drawing like two years back. And it has definitely evolved since then. I and I uh, started practicing drawing dragons a little bit more because I really started to like them. So I kinda got the body frame a little bit more detailed, like so like, this is probably a few months later, so like the snout, the head, and then I just did horns like that, and like that, and I didn't like, um, do like one on one side and one on the other, if that makes sense. And then after that, I just went straight down into the body, and again, did something like this. And then I... Actually, yeah, I didn't even con I didn't even do like any of like those line divider things, and then it was something like that, and uh, well, yeah, it's, it was something sort of like that. Um, I made the back like normal, and then I did the tail, so I had somewhat of the same uh, sort of style, I guess, in a way. I just didn't like I. I didn't quite have it all, like I didn't quite know exactly what I was doing. Um, so, oh yeah, and then the wing, I just kind of did like something sort of like that maybe, or it was like, I don't know, oh yeah, it was something like sort of like that, and because I didn't know how to draw like the dragon wing, like you know, like the basic dragon wing that's like sort of like that, and then that, and that. Like that sort of basic dragon wing, I did not know how to do that. So I just kind of did some, like, sort of like a bird wing in a way, or I, I don't know, I was just being lazy. Um, and then, so I kept that uh, body structure there for a little bit, and, um, and then after a while, I tried to make the wing look a bit more like a wing. I tried to make it like more of a dragon wing. I was trying to figure out how to do that. Um, so instead of doing that like little squiggle thing, I went and did this. So I was sort of on the right track in the way of how like you could like fold back your wing sort of thing. So it would be like, um, or like there's like a little thing there. And then it went up and over like that. And how you would fold it up, um, fold it back across like the thing something sort of like that I was trying to do that but it just it again I didn't really know how to do that so I kept practicing and so like I stayed like that for a little bit until I kind of realized like I, I looked at some pictures of dragon drawings and I realized oh yeah I need like sort of like a mouth sort of like this so like I tried like the uh, jaw so I tried doing that, but it was just a little squiggly and I kind of went overboard with it a little bit and that was sort of the mouth. <laughs> um, and like a really kind of long head and again kind of just like that again. Um, so yeah, that and then I guess I, it, it, didn't, it didn't really change a whole lot from there. Like, I figured out how to do, like, the the wing 
sort of thing, although like it used to be sort of like this, and then instead of it folding over like this, I just did like all of, like the sections here, which works. It just it looks better if it's folded over. Um, so yeah, and um, what was another thing I did? I it took me a little while to like figure out like um like you'd have like the head and then body. And then you'd have the, like, this part right here where it's, like, the leg. And then it took me a little while to figure out how to do, um, this. Like, you would just kind of go down. And before, a lot of the time, I would just kind of, like, widen it too much. Or, I, I don't know. But it took me, like, a little while to figure that out. And actually, like, I, it would be, like, I, I had that style for, like, a while. The, um... The one where it was just kind of like a very squiggly mouth and very kind of long thin head and then um like a like the rest of the body but i noticed that like the um the underbelly for one it was very very thin like it was like not even that and also the legs were kind of like toothpicks in a way and they were super long too so I, I realized that I did that wrong, so I fixed that up a little bit. And instead of doing that, I have figured out that I should do something sort of more kind of half and half. And for the legs, I should start up a little bit higher and then go down and don't go too far down, but go just kind of down a good amount. So... Yeah, and then, um, so, yeah, I just, after, like, a, a little while of practicing, I finally kind of got the hang of it, I realized that, like, I should do, instead of going, um, like, this and this, and then making it, I, it was a better idea for me to go, like, if I'm doing, like, a one-sided dragon head, to go like that, and then do, like, the curve of the neck. So, and then, like, if I wanted to do, um, the other thing, then, like, if I wanted to do, like, the other horn, then I would either go like that, or I would make, like, the back spikes, and I would do something sort of like that. Um, and then, like, the most current thing that I have figured out is, actually, I made a tutorial on, like, the two-sided dragon head. I'll just do a quick little overview here, so, like, where I would do the one horn here little space thing like the head here um and then go down and then have like the two eyes like right here and then like the nostrils here so yeah i'm not going to draw like my, my in like the entire body of like the dragon like of the dragon that i knew how to make now because that would just take too long um, but yeah, this, that's sort of like where, where I went from, like, uh, from this. Oh, wait, no, it doesn't have. From that to that, like from this to... something sort of like that uh that's not like my best drawing ever in the world but i'm just gonna r r like rushing and just doing like a quick sketch so something from like that to that i'd say that that's a pretty good improvement so yeah that is sort of the evolution of my drawings from like 
2016 to 2019, so, yeah, because, like, I, 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 like, I'm not, like, I don't have, like, natural talent of, like, some people who can just, like, easily draw and, like, make it, like, perfect and beautiful and whatever, I had to teach myself, like, everything, so, I think that's a pretty good accomplishment, so, yeah, I hope you like this video, I hope that you find it interesting, um, so, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you next week. Bye.